in the first place, when, you, when I want to make a sculpture, it's either I have a particular idea, but mostly we, when I have no idea, I just uh, look at a stone, and what I'm going to make you know, normally is already displayed on that shape of the stone. Well, uh, we moved to Tengeneng in 1966 uh, with my parents. I was a, a small boy, so I couldn't start sculpting. And finally, in 1978, I started sculpting. So I got the inspiration from my father since I grew up in an environment of sculptors. These uh, statues of uh, wood, so that the wax we use to polish it is able to penetrate inside. Because when it's not wood, then the wax is not able to get inside the, the statue. If you look at uh, my piece, it's similar to my father. They say, like father, like son. Yes, but we have a, a, a slightly different style looking at my piece. It, my, my father used to make a, um, a very uh, big nose and, and thick. And you can see my nose is uh, small and, and thin. And mostly I don't like to put mouths on my pieces. Like my father, who had different types of mouth he could place on his uh, pieces. My father, I can see him from this sculpture. I don't have any photograph from my father. Of the late Luigi Primero, one of the Tengenengesi master sculptors. 